Hey everyone, my name is Amina and I am a digital marketing internship trainee in IPSL Solutions. Today we are going to cover how to get started with Hootsuite. Hootsuite is a social media management platform which takes the form of a dashboard and supports social network integrations for Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn and YouTube. You can use Hootsuite to manage multiple social accounts, identify, publish, engage with your audience and generate leads all from one dashboard. Hootsuite offers four plans, professional, team, business and enterprise. You can choose a plan accordingly to meet your needs. Once you sign up, you can select a plan and start a 30-day free trial. Enter your name, your email address, and password. And click my create account. After you fill the payment details, you can hit the get started button. You will be prompted to connect to your social accounts upon initial setup. Click add social network and select the network. Here we will first add Facebook account. You need to authorize Hootsuite to access your account to be able to get all the functionalities it offers. Select the Facebook page you would like to add. Click done. Now let's add LinkedIn account similarly. Select the LinkedIn page you would like to connect and click done. Click next. Select the page and click add to dashboard. Hootsuite will auto populate a feed that shows your recently published posts and mentions from the accounts you added. Now anytime you want to connect additional accounts, you can go over to the My Profile button at the left bottom of your page and then click Social Networks and Teams button. Now we see the accounts connected. To add another network, click Private Network and select the network you would like to add. Let's add Twitter account here. Authorize Hootsuite to access the account. To get back to the dashboard, click on the Streams button in the Navigation toolbar. You can also add additional networks by going to the Streams tab by clicking Add Social Network. You may add additional accounts from here if you want. Now let's see how to monitor and engage with the accounts we added. Hootsuite streams are just like feeds in our Facebook and Twitter which display the content from our connected social accounts and allow us to engage in conversations, follow specific keywords and so on. Now bots are used to categorize and organize the streams. We can set up our bots and streams however we like but here I'm going to rename the bot to our social channel so it's easy to categorize and manage the streams. We are going to create separate boards for each channel. So let's create a board for Twitter and LinkedIn the same way we created for Facebook. Now let's add streams to the Twitter board. Here my tweets shows all tweets coming out of my Twitter account. The mention stream let me see every time I have been mentioned. We can search for keyword we like to follow like for example cakes. Now that's going to show me every time cakes have been mentioned across Twitter. Another feature here is we can filter the content by the number of followers or a keyword. And this will only show me posts 
of the accounts with more than 4000 followers and here if I type cupcakes it will show only the posts with cupcakes now if we click on the three dots we can choose to see content with only text or text plus image we could also share the stream with our team and there is also an option to delete as well as you can see we can directly engage with our audience by hitting reply like retweet etc so here I'm going to type thank you and hit send. You can even assign a team member to take necessary actions on a particular post. Anytime you are in streams, you can select add stream to create a new stream. Create a number of streams and scroll through them to see what works best for you. You can easily create and delete streams, so don't be afraid to explore. You can change the type of view to compact, standard or comfortable as you wish. Explore the views and select the one that best fits your needs. Okay. Now let's see how to create, schedule and publish your social media content to Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn and Instagram from one place. Click on the pencil icon in the navigation toolbar and click create. The new post window will pop up. Select the accounts. You can check the box beside the network you would like to post the content to. Let's select Twitter and Facebook accounts here. The message combos box will pop up next. Enter your content. You can add emojis, mentions or tags for a user or page or links. Let's add a link of bucket list travel here. The URL here is too long so we will click shorten it with Auli. As, as you craft your post you can review it using the preview next to it. We can upload an image or video from our computer or browse the media library from Hootsuite if we do not want to use the picture shown in the preview. Let's do that by selecting an image from the library. As you can see, you get an option to edit the image here itself which is a cool feature. You can set your location and also restrict the audience by age and location. Let's pick a date and time to publish the post so we don't have to worry about it. There is an option for auto schedule at the top. We can choose to turn it on if we would like Hootsuite to choose an optimal time to post. We can also adjust the auto schedule settings where we can select the frequency of messages and also select the days you want your messages to be scheduled on. As you can see this is the account and settings window. If we click account we see options to upload profile picture and give bio description. One important thing to note here is the time zone. We have to make sure that the time zone we are working in is set right here. I am in Dubai so that's looking good for me. Let's just turn off auto schedule for now and set a time and click schedule. Now that the post is scheduled, we can review or edit it before it's published or deleted anytime. To view your scheduled content, hit the publisher button in the navigation toolbar. Here you see all the accounts you have linked and the scheduled content.
In addition to viewing your scheduled content here, you can also create new posts and organize, delete or delete existing ones right from the calendar. If we click on the calendar icon seen below the post, you will be able to edit it. Also, you can delete or move to drafts. You can also change the date and time by simply dragging the post. The following views are available in the publisher. First one is planner. Here we review and manage your posts in a weekly calendar view. We can craft new content to publish by selecting a time block in the calendar. Next one is the content. View your past scheduled posts, view and manage all of your future scheduled and draft posts here. We can also see past, scheduled, require approval, etc. Next one is the promote. Here we can boost our Facebook or LinkedIn page posts to promote our content. Let's take a quick look at the rest of the options in the toolbar, though we are not going to discuss it in detail. Inbox. Hootsuite Inbox helps you engage with your audience and customers in one place like replying to messages, mentions, etc. Next one is the assignments. It lets you collaborate with teams and organization. You can assign posts or comments to team members and manage content with tags. Analytics is the next one. You can use analytics to measure the overall performance of your social media activity across multiple social networks. Uh, we have also got an option of mixed overview. So it will show the analytics from uh, all the connected accounts. The last thing we are going to look at is the app directory. Click my profile and then app directory. There are many apps which we can integrate with Hootsuite available here. Let's select Canva here. It's a free app which allows you to correct content directly from your Hootsuite dashboard. Click install. The app is installed instantly. So that's all on how we can set up a Hootsuite dashboard creating content and engaging with our audience. I hope you find this video helpful. If you have any questions or suggestions, please comment below. Thank you for watching.